Hello guys, I am Francesca Nightgrove and welcome back to Dragon Age Origins. Now, in this episode, you may remember that uh, we started our exile. So, yeah. Is it... Ooh, I think... Yeah, I'm going the wrong way. Ah, I need to go up here. Yeah. I was definitely going in the wrong direction. Right. Uh, ooh, oh, spider. Right, let's just loot these first. Get the spooder. Get the spooder out of the way. I think I'd literally have a panic attack if a spider the size of this. Get off! Get, get off, please, please. Please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. Get off, please. Thank you. But yeah, as I was saying, uh, I think I'd have a panic attack if the, if the spider, the uh, size of that, came running at me. Oh, I, oh, I triggered a trap. Whoops. <laughs> Come on then, Genlock. Let's put you out of your misery. Oh. Oh no, here's another one. Ow. Ow. Do you my ow. Please stop. <gasps> oh, okay. Right, so Lyrium. Uh, right. Dead Dwarf, what's that? Ooh, got some armor and a dagger. Nice. Right, so there's some stuff here that I need to loot as well. As you wish. Ooh, I'll take those. And that shield. I'm just stockpiling at this point. <laughs> Alright, so let's head down this way. Hmm. Hmm. I need to go up here first. Oh. Oh no, another, another giant scooter. Oh no, no, no. Oh, and what, what's that behind me? Oh, got the spider and there are deep stalkers. Great. <laughs> oh, ooh. As I said, I don't know what to make of these. They look like a weird cross between a dinosaur and an earthworm. Hmm. <laughs> deep stalkers are weird, weird, weird creatures. <laughs> Fire arrows, I'll take those. Right, now let's head down here. What is down here? The skeleton. Ooh, another shield, thank you. Right, oh, walks right into a web. <laughs> right, so let's head down this way. Oh, Another gun lock. Ooh, okay, block that one. Nice. <gasps> oh, I decapitated him. Whoops. <laughs> uh, don't know if that was meant to happen. Right, another gun lock. Let's put you out of your misery. That was easy. Dead dwarf, mail, armor, and a shield and some coins and a health poultice. Right, uh, let's get rid of you first because I'm literally at a crossroads and I have no idea where I want to go. So let's go this way. Mm. Actually, is that a good idea because that's where the main path is? I don't want to check out what's behind me, so I'm just going to go back on myself and check out what is actually behind me before I uh, carry on with the, you know, with the quest. Uh, oh no, two dead dwarfs and a lot of dead stalkers. Ah, great. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm surrounded by them. Why? Come on, let's put these guys out of their misery. <laughs> oh my gosh, this leader is 
not going down without a fight. Oh my gosh, I keep on missing. No! No! Ah! No! Come on, you've always got her. You got her. Alright. You got it. Alright, now to put the lesser pests out of their misery. And the last one. Yay! Oh, I keep on missing. Why? Oh. Got it. Alright, so now to loot the dwarves. Wow, you got a lot of armor on you. And you've just got one set of armor. Okay. And the Deep Stalker has a Lyrium potion. Okay. Right, now I can go down here. Right. So, what is actually down here? I know this is where the main path is, like the main road. Uh, oh, here they are! Lady Iduke, what are you doing here alone? Where are your troops? <sighs> I am Lady Iduke and no longer, unfortunately. I was betrayed by my brother. Lord Trian? No. Balin. Trian is dead. I see. The brutal intrigue of the Dwarven Court continues now. Your father intimated as much. There is no reason for you to walk these deep roads and die for something you did not do. You have already proven yourself both resourceful and skilled. And I would expect nothing less than what I do. When last we spoke, you told me you wished to join our order. I imagine this isn't quite what you meant, but you may still find great honor. As leader of the Grey Wardens in Ferelden, I would like to formally invite you to join our order. I would be honored. Then welcome. We leave immediately for Ostagor to join with the human force facing the Darkspawn hordes, led by King Kayla. Stay close. There are still Darkspawn around every corner. And we are finally out of the deep roads. Finally. But now... we head to Ostagar. Where the rest of the Darkspawn... Um, you know, are going to share their faces because this is a blight. This is the start of a blight. So, yeah. Wait until this is finished loading and the story will continue. We will be traveling south through the hinterlands to the ruin of Ostagar on the edges of the Korkari Wilds. The Tevinter Imperium built Ostagar long ago to prevent the Wilders from invading the northern lowlands. It's fitting we make our stand here, even if we face a different foe within that forest. The King's forces have clashed with the Darkspawn several times, but here is where the bulk of the Horde will show itself. There are only a few Grey Wardens within Ferelden at the moment, but all of us are here. This blight must be stopped, here and now. If it spreads to the north, Ferelden will fall. Ho oh there, Duncan. King Kaelan. I didn't expect a... A royal welcome? I was beginning to worry you'd miss all the fun. Not if I could help it, your majesty. Then I'll have the mighty Duncan at my side in battle after all. Glorious. The other wardens told me you'd found a promising recruit. I take it this is she? Allow me to introduce you, your majesty. There's no need to be so formal, Duncan. We'll be shedding blood together after all. Hello there, friend. Might I know your name? I'm Vera, Your Majesty. Pleased to meet you. The Grey Wardens are desperate to bolster their numbers, and I, for one, am glad to help them. 
It's good to see one of the honorable stout folk outside Aldemar. <sighs> Leaving Aldemar wasn't really my idea. Not really. Sounds like there's a story behind that. You must regale me with it sometime. <sighs> if your majesty wishes. I do. I'll make sure to have the finest dwarven brew brought up from the palace cellars. After we've dealt with the blight, of course. I've been to Orzammar. King Endrin invited my father to a grand proving long ago. How does Endrin fare these days? I am his daughter, and he was fine when I last saw him. Well, it seems your story may be even more interesting than I suspected. Allow me to be the first to welcome you to Ostagar. The Wardens will benefit greatly with you in their ranks. You're too kind, your majesty. Majesty. I'm sorry to cut this short, but I should return to my tent. Logain waits eagerly to fool me with his strategy. Your uncle sends his greetings and reminds you that Red Cliff forces could be here in less than a week. <laughs> Eamon just wants in on the glory. We've won three battles against these monsters, and tomorrow should be no different. I didn't realize things were going so well. I'm not even sure this is a true blight. There are plenty of dark spawn on the field, but alas, we see no sign of an arch demon. Disappointed, Your Majesty. I'd hoped for a war like in the tales. You know, a king riding with the fabled grey wardens against a tainted god. But I suppose this will have to do. Now, I must go before Logan sends out a search party. Farewell, grey wardens. What the king said is true. They've won several battles against the Darkspawn here. And yet you don't sound very reassured. Just saying. Despite the victory so far, the Darkspawn horde grows larger with each passing day. By now they look to outnumber us. I know there is an arch demon behind this, but I cannot ask the king to act solely on my feelings. What would you have him do? Wait for reinforcements. We sent a call out west to the Grey Wardens of Orle, but it will be many days before they can join us. Our numbers in Ferelden are too few. We must do what we can, and look to Terran Logain to make up the difference. To that end, we should proceed with the joining ritual without delay. Uh, what do you need me to do? Feel free to explore the camp here as you wish. All I ask is that you do not leave it for the time being. There is another Grey Warden in the camp by the name of Alistair. When you're ready, seek him out and tell him it's time to summon the other recruits. Until then, I have business I must attend to. You may find me at the Grey Warden tent on the other side of this bridge, should you need to. Right. Right, so now all the codex entries and the quest has updated, uh, I'm just going to level up my character. Uh, next. Uh, uh, do -do. What should I pick? I'm going to pick Herbalism next. And then dual striking and death hands right so i hope you enjoyed this video if you did please leave a like and subscribe for my content and i shall see you in the next one bye